hey guys welcome back to my channel and i'm back at it again with another video for you guys but before we get into this video make sure you like comment share and subscribe and make sure you turn on your post notification bell so you know when i upload a new video or a vlog so yeah and i just want to say thank you guys for the continuous support that you guys have been giving me like i literally appreciate you guys even though i don't show it that much but just want to come in here and say thank you guys for the love and the support and all uh, yeah <laughs> and i know i should be giving you guys some more content since it's summertime but i'm trying i'm working on it i'm working on it i'm working on it because been. i'm telling you even though like, my last video was like two weeks ago I can't tell when last I picked up my camera. I picked up my camera probably like a month ago. That was the last time I picked up my camera. Which isn't good. But I try to vlog for you guys. Like what? A couple days ago. But it didn't it didn't go well. So yeah. <laughs> but anyways. I, just, I want you guys to also give me like video suggestions. Of like what kind of videos you guys want to see me do. Like, that's why y'all here, to help me out with some video ideas and stuff like that. Don't be afraid to comment. You're already watching it. So, don't be afraid to comment what kind of video suggestions you guys want to see me do and etc. And yeah. So, today's video going to be, um, you know, you know, you know, you know your girl like to do her DIY videos and I'm back oh, with a summer DIY video and this one is different I and I hope it comes out good because I want to wear it like I want to wear it I want to look cute so let me tell y'all what I'm gonna make I'm gonna do a bikini a two-piece bikini um outfit DIY, yeah, and I got, I got these, so, before all that interruption, I don't even know where I stopped that, but anyways, today's video will be a DIY bikini, and I don't have no sewing machine, so I gotta sew it by hand, I'm gonna show you, let me, you know what, let me just show you guys all the pieces that I got, and where I got it from. Everything that I'm showing you guys, I got it from Walmart. And yeah. So I got these fabric. I wanna do I wanna do two bikinis. So I have these fabric that I got from Walmart. They were like two dollars each. So yeah. And I got some scissors and a, whatever this is called, a fabric cutter. And I think this is easier than the scissors. So I was like, why not just get this where I could just use this to cut it versus using the scissors. Even though I'm going to use the scissors anyways. But yeah, I think this was like $5 at Walmart. I got some trade. Some <laughs> some tread. I tread them, yeah? I them, call. Yeah. <laughs> I got some um yeah some tread to sew it and whatever and i have some elastic elastic band for the you know to hold it up and what else i got and i also got a fabric glue because the video that i watched she was like you could also use fabric glue so i was like maybe i could do one where i sew it by hand and then the next one I try to use the fabric glue just to see how it actually works and stuff. So I think this was like, I don't want to lie, but it probably was like $3, $2. And yeah, that's basically all I got for this DIY. Yeah. Cheap, easy, cute. And I hope this actually comes out good because fingers crossed. <laughs> fingers crossed so let's just jump right into that video okay y'all so i don't know if you can see but this is how big the fabric is i hope y'all can actually see it 
but yeah this is how big the fabric is and you want to make sure you get an old bikini um an old bikini bottom and top that fits perfect how you want it to fit and i have some what i'm gonna do before i cut this out first i'm gonna basically trace it on this paper and then cut the paper out and put it on the, let me i'm gonna trace this out first let y'all see what i'm doing because this is my first time doing it so i hope it actually comes out you know at least decent so i'm gonna use a marker So this is the back, wait, <laughs> this is the front, I'm going to do the front first, and then after I'm going to do the back. Now I'm gonna cut the front out.
I don't have that much paper, so. I'm gonna use what I have. So let's see if they both the same size. Nope. And I put it on and see what it fits like. This is like we fit. Let's see this one. I think this this piece a good fit. This a little bit bigger. So I'm gonna fold this to make sure both sides is, you know, in place. Oh, this paper look crooked. Oh. And as I said, I'm gonna do the same thing that I did with the um, with the bottom. So let's see. I think it's kind of leave, but whatever. And you know, instead of you instead of using this next one, I'm gonna just use the same one. So. The boobs are like the same size. So yeah. So yeah. Just to make it a little easier on myself. What I'm going to do. Because I want the tops to be the same size. So I already cut this part. Of this. This left or right boobs out. <laughs> and yeah. And as I said, I want it to be the same size, so instead of using the paper, I'm just use this right here as the outline. Damn, I'm still all the way down here. Yo, I got to get in the camera more cuz y'all can't see what the hell I'm doing. Like I'm showing it to my damn self. <laughs> I'm gonna feed it through again cuz I want to make sure I have enough space in between here to put the elastic band. Okay, yeah, so this is what it looks like when I feed it through. I totally forgot that I have the glue. So since I already started this, I'ma just sew it. I'ma just start go straight into sewing it first. So I got a pink thread. It might just, I think it's the same pink. Ooh, that's purple right here, but Whatever. We gonna make it work. I'm not a sewer, so if y'all know this, if y'all know how to sew, don't come for me. So let's see. I'm gonna probably sew it on this side. Okay, y'all. Uh, so I don't know if because. I'm not too good at sewing. Why is it taking me so long? But this is the first one I did. And I had to like cut the little sides so I could bend it. And also it looks even. <laughs> I hope y'all can see like the stitches that I did are. Yeah. And I'm going to do the same thing to this one. I already did this. I already did this, the top part or the bottom part. So I basically did a little split right here so I could fold it and sew it. But, and I did it again because I did the same thing for the first one. I cut it way too much because I'm only doing, I'm only sewing this much part of it. So... I hope it actually fits good. This looks small for my boobs. <laughs> ah. I don't know why is it taking me so long to sew it though. Like it's taking me mad long. 
Like, I don't know what I'm doing. But I'm, you know what? I'm going to take my time. I'm not even going to rush it. Because I want it to come out, you know, looking bomb. So, yeah. As I said, I had cut this part way too much. But I hope I could fix it. I know my boobs not this small. Girls. <laughs> I'm going to make it work, though. I'm going to make it work. I should have cut it some more. But we'll see when I finish with everything. And then I'm going to move on to the bottom piece now. Because I already do these. And the same thing I did with the top piece. With the top is the same thing I'm going to do with the bottom. I'm going to line it out. Well... Yeah, I'm going to outline it where I want to sew it. You know? So, yeah. So, this piece is the back. Maybe I don't need that much. So, I already got my four pieces right here. So, this is the top. Even though they, look, they don't look like the same size, but, yeah. And it's the bottom. This is the bottom. This is the top and this is the bottom. Or whatever. Or this is the back. I gotta sew these together, though. Like. I should have sewed them before I came out here, but I'm gonna just sew it right now. And then I'm going to show you guys how I put, well, not how I put the elastic bands through, but I'm going to use a, a bobby pin. I'm going to stop what the hell you're going to fight myself. I'm going to fight myself. I don't know who be watching my videos, so. If I make sure some people understand me, I say. Shit, they don't want to understand anything. Search or how to understand proper. I'm gonna be over here talking like some American ass YouTuber. Fuck that shit. Shut up, Paul. But, anyways, I'm gonna feed. Well, not feed. I'm gonna use this bobby pin to um, basically put the elastic band through okay y'all so i feel like i've been doing this all day long and as i said i think i had cut the elast elastic band too sh Ooh, i got hiccups but I had cut the elastic band too short, so like, like the top of the bikini gonna be smaller than the um, the bottom. If y'all get what I'm saying, and this is how I stitch. Ooh, I got hiccups. This is how I stitch the panties. I should have did it inside out, but yeah, this is how I did the panties and whatever. I'm. Um, about to try it on. Oh, got hiccups. I'm gonna try it on so you could, you guys could see like what it actually looks like on me. Hopefully, it comes out. And as I said. I'm going to continue this video tomorrow and my, I'm going to try to use the glue to see how that goes because sewing it kind of took a very long time. I don't know if it's because I don't know how to sew or what, but let's try this out and see what it looks like. Yeah. It's so good. Okay, so this is the first piece. I see how it looks. I'm going to have to sew this part some more so it could stay down. This looks cute. And this is my first try too. But I'm going to continue tomorrow. I'm going to show you how the booty looks like. 
Damn, I need some more. I'm going to cut these, um, the elastic band some more so it's not just. Because I messed up. So, yeah. This looks nice, right?